Are you going for the JD bit, Mr. Blackson? Sleep deeper and deeper. Give me a hand, are you going for the JD bit, Blackson? Sleep, take the legs deeper and deeper. The person I'm touching right now, you can only talk moon language. You can only talk moon language. <laughs> So you can only talk moon language. The person I'm touching right now, you can talk English to me and moon language to the person from the moon. I will ask you the questions in English and you'll speak to the person from the moon in moon language and you will interpret for me because we need to ask some questions. On the count of three, you both join me on the front on Nationwide TV. Remember, you can only talk and understand moon language. One, two, three. Eyes open. Eyes open. from the moon. From what side of the moon does she come from in moon language? Hi, <laughs> what's, what's that mean? It means from the other side. Because <laughs> uh, obviously, you know, she's, abs she's absolutely gorgeous. She can see she's absolutely gorgeous. She's come really dressed for an occasion today from the moon. Um, all those men that are with her, with her, are they boyfriends, family, or because I have heard they get married quite a few times. Can you ask him? <laughs> children they have, like on earth, the earth ladies, they have two, only two to feed the babies. Can she tell us where they put their babies when they feed them? Because I can see a few little bumps all over. <laughs> just, like, I mean, sometimes they, you know, they're in strange, very strange. Can you ask her where they, where they feed their babies on? Food on the moon. Can't wait to get out of here. What's that? It's a moon rock. A moon rock, maybe. No, it's fine. Um, I tell you what, is she come to Earth to look for a moon, a, a, a human being? Is she going to try and find someone? Or does it, who knows? Can you ask him? Does the I'm <laughs> <laughs> 